Hi everyone and welcome to Smashbox where we look at the latest in gaming and tech trends. I noticed a little trend today uh, in the last seven days using the search term iPhone. It seems that a lot of people want to know how to turn off the auto updates on their iPhone. Um, I'm not sure why uh, it seems to be something happening in America, but I thought I'd just quickly show you an easy way to turn off your auto updates on your iPhone. And uh, I'm pretty sure this will work for the last few operating systems, but I am on iOS 14. So you need to first uh, locate where your settings uh, app widget is. Mine's right here. And once you're in your settings, you simply need to find the general tab, which is right here. Under general, the top two options uh, about and software update. So you want to click on software update and this will tell you your current operating system. I oh, know, sorry, this will tell you uh, the next operating system that is available, the most current. And uh, under the normal settings, it will just be, it will download that and install it automatically. A lot of people don't like that. So under the automatic updates tab at the very bottom right here, we need to uh, disengage the download iOS updates or you can ju just go uh, you can get, let it download in the background when you're connected automatically but you can choose to manually install it so it won't install until you say so but if you switch off the iOS automatic updates it won't download in the background and it won't install automatically now if we go back to menu options back to where we say about and software update you can actually see what your current operating system is on the About tab right there. And this will give you the name of your phone and the current software version, the model, all those kinds of things. I've just grayed out some of that other information because it's got serial numbers and model numbers on there. If you scroll down through this section, you'll also see all sorts of data about your phone currently. And once you've turned off the auto updates, if you ever want to do a manual installation uh, of an operating system, you simply go to your settings again, go to the same general tab, select software update. You can select the update and install it from this page here. So I've just manually selected to download iOS 14.3, which will update from 14.2 on my phone. That just gives you a lot more control over it and it stops it from giving you those forced update messages that you get as a little notification. I hope you enjoyed this video. I try to keep it nice and short and to the point. Please do subscribe to the channel for future content. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.